I've been trying to focus on my career, but I'm still upset about Darren. Since I heard he was with another girl, we've done nothing but argue. Going, staying at another girl's house, buying her a takeaway every night, buying her a phone. But I want us to be friends. He's agreed to meet me to talk it all through. So I've invited Darren for some lunch because I just feel like we need a proper adult, honest, open conversation. I mean, I want him to come clean about everything that went on with the girl and I want answers and I want them today. Alright. Yeah. I got your drink. Same? Not a lot really. Um I just really want um a, like an honest, open and whatever chat. I so I can move forward with my life. It's fine. So what did you ask me? Why did you go with that other girl? Like what what made you think like that, that was okay? I wasn't doing anything wrong, I was single, I'm a single man. I've spoken to the girl. She she's painted quite a portrait. You know, you and her had something quite more than just a friendship. But I've not done anything bad. I wasn't with you, I wasn't... Do you know what I mean? Like, I, it's just someone that I met on a night out and I've went back to hers. I've stayed there probably six, seven times. My feelings were still for you, do you know what I mean? But even though I hated you, my feelings were there for you, do you know what I mean? Like, I didn't want nothing between me and her. Do, so do you think you've done anything wrong to me in this whole situation? No, I don't think I've done anything wrong. The thing is, when I was in Bulgaria with my daughter, you, you, had, you, you was bringing lads back to the house and that. I didn't I bring just, lads back to the house. You did. You're going to do that while me and my, my and your daughter are on order. You can't keep messing around with people's emotions. Like, one minute, you love me. The next, you can't stand me. Well, I'm done with this conversation anyway. I wasn't with you, so what have I done wrong? Yeah, but right, Simple. leave the girl aside. I don't, I don't, care. Care. No, I don't, don't want to be with you, I end up. Trying to make me like a f***ing idiot. Darren, look, I just want to say, like, that conversation is done now, do you know what I mean? Like, Regardless of whether you've done me wrong, you think I've done you wrong, I, I generally care about you from the bottom of my heart. I don't want you so to... So I just want to be left alone. OK. I didn't want to fall out with Darren today. I thought we could clear the air, but I was wrong. I'm hungry. Yeah. Right, we'll wait there, then. I've been trying to forget about the arguing with Darren and focus on my career. And today is the day I find out if I got the job I applied for in the beauty salon. Hello? Yeah, speaking. Thank you so much for coming in. We really, really enjoyed meeting you. But um, unfortunately, at the moment, we are looking for somebody who can give us some time hours. Yeah. Um, so that would require every single Saturday and every single Thursday night. And I know that's something that you can't do at the moment. Yeah. Um, so unfortunately, um, that, that position is, is what we need. So but unfortunately, we, we can't offer that at the moment. I'm really sorry about that. that that's OK. And thank you for um, your time and obviously taking me into consideration. And I don't want it to hurt your confidence or anything like that because you did a really good job on the interview. Oh, thank you. Um, and it really was nice to meet you and I wish you all the best with everything. All right, all thank, right you. thank you. Bye. Bye. Well, this isn't great. Today, yeah, this is not great. I just don't know what Mummy's going to do now. I am really, really disappointed. I feel yeah. really sad about this. I'm actually not joking. Ah. I just feel like my life... Ah. Well, where do I go from here now?